Hey folks, day four here at Abundant Life Church of Christ. Um, we're going to start our training today. So the main thing we got to do is run the cables for the back TV, the input from the TV from upstairs, as well as getting sound to the ATEM. Now the cables I ordered were not here in time, so I think... I'm hoping I have enough cable I can get around there, or they might have another cable that I can use to get our audio down there, but that's the goal. Um, knock the TV out first, run the cables, and then we go from there. So let's get inside and let's get to work. All right, working backwards and cleaning up everything. Got a plate here, got to get another one here. Got that closed up, got the ceiling closed up. So I forgot to bring my vacuum but we're gonna come here I'm sure they got one clean up our mess now moving backwards to running the two fiber optic cables fiber optic HDMI cables one to the computer upstairs and then the other one in reverse that's gonna send the signal to the TV once we got that then we'll get up here and hang the TV alrighty folks we are making good progress but I got a phone call and we got to go into daddy mode my daughter is not feeling good so I'm cutting out here for a second to go pick her up from school and she's gonna be with me for a little bit until I, my mom gets done and I take her back there. So let me get to the school, go pick up my princess. Alrighty folks, it's up. Just gotta level it, we had to take it down. It was pulling away, so I have a security bar on the back of this mount, on the back of the TV, that's gonna be secured to this metal um, floor joist. So it ain't going nowhere. So now I'm a, all this extra, I'm gonna pull, and instead of it being clumped right there, I'm gonna zip tie the extra back here. So, well, actually, probably right here, because this is where I have all the extra at. And just put it right here power on the TV and then we go from there all right so we got the x32 on the network right now and we're just trying to attempt to get the iPad to talk to it as well as the computer which needs to be turned on alrighty folks guess what we are done y'all ready for a detailed video let's go Front screen. Let's go over here to the media booth first. Well, actually, no, let's go through here. <laughs> All right, you see the projectors we're running 1080p 60 coming there. Turn around. There's a back display and camera number one. Go over here to the left. There's our right camera. Now let's walk over here to the band, another projector. But let's go over here to the band. Have our personal mixers that are not on. They're on now. There for the drummer, another for the bass, keyboardist, and organ. And you know I gotta get on here and play. Piano, if somebody was here, it can pull down the one down here. Let's go up here on the stage. The other rack has the mics connected to it. Here are the dual S16s, our snakes connected. All 
all of the cable work completely hidden because it's up under the stage front camera right there did I vacuum back here let's see I can do some more work but we close this off close that off we're running the cable in the wall for the snake that goes all the way to the back that's running across that beam All right, last camera number four, right there for the right. That was replacing where there used to be a cam uh, camera right there. Thought I pulled all that slack up, but we'll do that. Running through here, through the ceiling, and into the media room. All right, so got the ATEM right here with our POE switch on our surge. We flip that, that turns everything off. Deck link, mini recorder 4K, that's bringing in a line out directly from there into here. We've cleaned up a whole lot of stuff back there, got all the cables sorted up. Up here, now because of how we have it, we don't even need the HDMI splitter anymore because ultimately we ended up running everything SDI and then converting it over to um, HDMI so the only feed we got right now is this one and I don't know why I don't know why the SDI is blinking like that because that the SDI now from there is going directly Yeah, that's going directly to the back TV. That's strange. But oh well, we got a signal on all our displays. Now let's go check out the other piece of the sound system that we have since replaced. Come back around the corner. Yes, we're going in a circle. Come on up here. Got the cable secured through that runner here. Got these wrapped around here right now because that's the easiest way to get them. Everything else is dropping back there and I definitely need to get these. Set these over here so I don't forget them. But now, our sound system here. All of that actually can go away because we're just using this HDMI splitter now for the projectors. All of that and all the switches can go away. This is the ProPresenter system that does have the software that can control the X32. This is the same software that's downstairs to where up here, if you're here, you can change the main house downstairs. We will be on the live stream mix. But that whole board has since been replaced with this. Now there are two pieces that have not been in because they haven't been delivered. We're gonna connect back here a Bluetooth XLR connection that will allow any phone or tablet to be connected without the jack, even though it is configured as such. So we got all our channels here, one through 16, 17 through 32, right there. Our auxes that we just saw, our buses, we only got one right now, I don't know why that's up, but that is for our live stream mix. All the rest of them we will configure at a later point. And that is it folks. So Abundant Life Church of Christ, thank you so much. Thank you. I appreciate the fact that you trusted me to do this. Um, it was a lot of work. I couldn't have done it without some assistance here. Let me see if I can get them on camera here. But thank you so much. Um, this was, I don't want to say it was a big project, but um, it greatly enhanced the stuff that was going on here. And here's my assistant here who helped me. There's no way I could have done any of this without him. Held the ladder so I didn't fall or nothing like that. So 
Um, before anybody gets here for training, what, what's your thoughts of the system compared to how it was originally? A hundred percent turnaround from upgrade of where we were to where we are right now. So we're on our way. Thank you so much, AJ. <laughs> Appreciate it. All right, folks. So that was it. Let me know if you have any questions. Links is down below to everything that we used here on this install. If you're interested in me coming and doing a consultation or on site, as long as, well, actually, I travel anywhere now, but um, link is down below, ajhomes.com slash consultations. Um, again, thank you so much. So if you like this type of content, appreciate a like, consider subscribing, hit that bell, that way you get notified when we come out with other videos to help modernize your media ministry. Thanks for watching, folks. This is AJ, and we will catch you on the next video. Later.